Breaking news. Firefighters are trying to get a four alarm fire under control at a warehouse in Etna. This is a live look from News Chopper 2. The fire broke out a couple of hours ago to force firefighters to evacuate people from nearby buildings. And for miles around, people have been seeing the smoke rising from the building. We have team coverage tonight. Brenda Waters and Amy Wattis are at the scene gathering details. Let's get right to it with Amy with details about what's inside that warehouse. Amy. Yeah, that's right. There's been a lot happening out here in Edna. This fire has been going on for almost three hours. Let's take a look at the scene now. You can see the firefighters have put a good uh, amount of fire out here. They just finished pouring water on this building. You can still see the, the ladders up, though, and still some smoke uh, coming from the roof of this uh, warehouse here. This is a store express. It's basically a storage facility that houses expensive vehicles, expensive boats, things like that. We don't know how this fire started, but again, firefighters have been out here for almost three hours. I do want to mention, though, one firefighter was injured, minor injuries, taken to a local hospital to get checked out. Now, if you plan on traveling through this area, you're not going to be able to. We are at Bridge and Butler Street. Ever, it's blocked off multiple intersections throughout the town of Edna blocked off at this hour. Several people nearby just watching this fire in amazement. Thick, dark smoke coming from this building several, several feet high. You can see it from 28. Take a listen to one guy. He lives nearby and describes how he saw the smoke. This is crazy. I can't even breathe right now. We heard the sirens. We heard the sirens and we heard like helicopters at first and we went and checked out the action. I just saw all the smoke and I'm, a, I'm afraid of all the smoke and inhaling this smoke the right now. Disappearing in front of me. Say that again? The firemen are disappearing in front of me. It's like disappearing into the smoke. It's scary. As you heard, yeah, just very scary for people out here. The smoke was so thick you could barely breathe when you were out here on scene. Firefighters disappearing through that smoke. Thankfully, that smoke has dissipated. We do have some uh, volunteers out here, some uh, local women we spoke with from the Roots of Faith Church in Sharpsburg. They're basically a disaster relief organization, and they came out here in their free time to deliver of water and leftover uh, snacks from flood relief and delivered it to all of that stuff to people working in the area, all the emergency responders. So very kind of those people. The Red Cross, the, the uh, Salvation Army out here as well. We'll be out here throughout the remainder of our newscast and bring you updates. For now, we are live in Aetna. Amy Wattis, KDKA News.